bought this from Walmart. It was in my Walmart grocery haul. Let's open this up. I want to make a truffle with some cheddar cheese, egg, and sausage and see how that turns out. I should just get a knife and cut this, but oh well. I wanted a pink one. They said they had a pink one online when I went to Walmart, at my Walmart location, but I couldn't find it in there. But they had red, they had like a sandwich maker thing. They had a heart-shaped waffle maker. So this is what this one looks like. It's about the size of my hand. Cute. It's gonna make a good waffle hopefully let me wash it really quick gotta rinse this up before i use it what's it say the power and preheat indicator will let you know when it's time to start cooking so i guess this light right here will let you know all right okay i did like kind of rinse it with water i'm not sure you're supposed to do that because you're supposed to take a damp cloth and wipe it. I'm gonna put water in it. Hopefully it still works. All right, so I'm gonna dry it and then cook some sausage. Do a sausage patty first. All right, mm, let's just heat it up and see what happens. This is not wet, so. So supposedly this light right here is supposed to tell you when it's ready or not ready. Okay, the light disappeared, so I think it's ready. Let's drop a sausage patty in there. And I'm not gonna put no oil in there because, ooh, that's like smoking hot. Wow. I'm gonna press it down. I wonder how long this is going to take to cook. It's been like two minutes. Just junk is so smoky. Oh my gosh. Let's see. Oh, I don't know. I might flip it over. Actually, I don't think I need to flip it over. Let me get some tongs. Uh, I don't know if it's cooked. I should cut it and see if it's cooked. Oh, look how fast that was. Took two minutes. Can y'all see that's cooked in there? You might not be able to see. That took two minutes though. I'm gonna do one more. Smash it down. It's a little bit on the like juicy wet side. Okay, the last sausage is done. I'm not gonna grease it because there's already oil in here. I'm gonna make that truffle now. So, I think you just lay down cheese. I'm using mild cheddar cheese. Let's just lay some of this down. Are you supposed to close it? I don't know. I'm not gonna close it yet. I'm gonna put an egg. Let's drop an egg in there. an egg then I'm gonna put more cheese on it just gonna spread a little bit more 
My hands are wet. All right, let's put more cheese on top of this egg. I'm not really sure how much you're supposed to put. Okay, let's close this up and see what it's gonna do. All right, it's been two minutes. Oh. I think I should put more cheese. Hopefully this is gonna get a little bit crispier. Some oil is dripping out from the sides. I'm gonna close it for a little bit longer. All right, it's been like another minute. It's been three minutes total. I don't think it's gonna get any crispier. It's pretty oily, I think. That's how it looks. That's just like egg and cheese. Well, it is just egg and cheese. Uh, I think I'm just supposed. To, I'm thinking I'm supposed to put more cheese than this. It took like 10 minutes to make this breakfast, which is not bad. If I added more cheese, it would have been crispier, I think. There's lots of oil everywhere. Let's see. It's pretty good. I think it was just cheese though. Not a bad breakfast. Here's our dinner tonight. We just have the cucumber and tomato salad. And then some fried chicken. I haven't fried chicken in a very long time. So hopefully this tastes good. The chicken was okay. It wasn't as crispy, but some of it was not fully cooked, so they cut it in half and put it in the air fryer, which made it much crispier. So, <clears throat> we're done with dinner. I'm done with cleaning up after dinner. I'm about to edit this video, so this is going to be the end of it. I am going to insert some clips that we got from over the weekend when we went to um, Texas. So... That's gonna be right now. I forgot to add one more thing before I close out this video. Um, this waffle maker, it's all right. I mean, it's only $9 or less than $9. So you get what you pay for. It's hard to clean because you can't submerge it in water. The cooking plates, you can't take it off. So, and then it like dripped, like the oil and stuff dripped under, through the bottom, I guess, onto the counter. So it's okay, but next time there shouldn't be too much oil. I guess you can't really put sausage in there. I don't know, but it was all right. It's cute and it was really easy to use, but just cleaning it wasn't really great. Okay, another thing guys, this trash can, remember I told you in one of those other videos that it has not been working properly for two years and then Daniel changed out the batteries and stuff and it still didn't work properly. But now he just changed, like when I say it didn't work properly, last time it didn't open, the top didn't open all the way. It was supposed to open all the way. But now he figured it out. It opens all the way. It's because you're supposed to change the battery and then hold this button for five seconds to reset it. Because he read the instructions back through. there. So now we got a working trash can again because it's been... I would say we've used, been using that like that, like broken for at least two years. So it's good to have a functioning trash can. And I was like, the next time I buy a trash can, I was going to buy it from Costco because if anything breaks, you can just go return it and get all your money back at Costco, you know? That's one thing I love about Costco. You can return anything. You used to be able to turn, return like electronics, like TVs and 
computers, laptops and stuff, but they changed the policy on that. But stuff like that you can return. So anyways, I'll catch you on the next one and stay tuned for those clips. We're all over here in our own section over here. There's this hole over there. But then, <laughs> we got somebody sitting over there. Yep, because it's a heavy They didn't want a discrimination lawsuit. Yeah, because it was sauce. It was. I did it. Where are you recording, honey? Same video. Yeah, this banana's too. Should I get her a good time? I said, yeah, have a good time. Everybody have a good time. No, I didn't. We're in Texas at the Spring Hill Hotel. All of us eating here. How do you flip this around? Oh, the casino is 30 minutes away. Uh uh. Yeah. All of us up in two rooms. Oh, excuse me. Has all our food right here. Lots and lots of food. Hello, everyone. Just I don't know. My mom told me to record. Hello, hello. Oh, true. We haven't been together like this in a long time. We have road trippers and people who flew. It's an adjacent room. Two bedrooms. Bukri's not eating. It's so quiet over here. I don't know, we're just recording. My mom told me to record a video. Whose phone is this? Is that mine? Yeah, is this yours? How's the food, everybody? Very good. All the food. Everybody want a boiled egg and egg right here? Look at that. From home. Fresh from home. Yeah. That look good. Very fancy eating. Who made that? Uh, him. Wow. Mm -hmm. Wow. We'll take some plates with us. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's not Facebook Live. <laughs> hmm? I said it's not Facebook Live. My life when you eat that. Don't think about it. Don't think about it. Don't think about it.